Morning loves, we are on our way to a little Dubai staycation. This is actually the first staycation we've ever done in Dubai and I've been here eight years. We're headed to the Anantara on World Islands. It just opened up. It's the first luxury resort on the World Islands. So you have to go to the Palm and take a boat from the Anantara Palm all the way to the World Islands. The vlog is a little different for my channel, so let me know if you like it in the comments. And let's get ready for the staycation. wanted to let you know the package that we took the special rate if you're part of the rewards program that they have and then you get 20% off of some of the spa services and a free upgrade if it's available when you check in so we're doing a Monday through a Wednesday staycation and we got the upgrade booked for a room where you could open up the doors and walk onto the beach but the upgrade from that room has a private pool and I'm so excited. I can't wait. They do like the floating breakfast. So let me show you the bill before I ramble on too much more. You walk in the door and there are two closets, a little his and hers. They've already brought our luggage. It was here even before we arrived and you have even more storage over here on this side with a safe. We continue on, you have a desk where I've just dumped all my stuff already. So this is what I'm wearing. It's a little green linen top from ASOS and my skirt is Zimmerman and then we'll move over here and I think I'll show you the bathroom first the toilet over to the side here and then you have this gorgeous bathtub and a very long bathroom the shower is just like open onto the floor we have his and her sinks with a lot of extra towels and you have bath products here and the bathroom opens up onto the pool lookout and you have an outdoor shower as well but let me bring you into the room. I think it's, you have two doors, so we came in that door, and here's the other door, and look at this, you guys. How beautiful. We have complimentary tea and water and coffee in the room, and then we've got this gorgeous living room, and they added this beautiful platter of fruits that we can enjoy, and of course there's like a TV over here, and then the little bit where you have like snacks and like cold drinks, these are like chargeable to the room, and here is the best bit. Are you ready for this view? How stunning is this? Wow. You've got your little sun loungers on the side, There's even a little table and chairs. to change, order some lunch, and enjoy this pool for the afternoon. We're going to do this observation deck restaurant that they have that has a view of the Dubai skyline. It's a bit foggy today, so I think that maybe we'll move that to tomorrow, and we might go to the beach restaurant for dinner tonight, so I will take you along with that. Lunch has just arrived, and it looks amazing. So they do gluten-free bread. They even made me special gluten-free fries. They have a superfood salad, a pasta that's also gluten-free, the normal fries, normal bread, and oh my gosh. Look at this with a view, just so stunning. Because I am super, super pale, I have to go with a sun hat, sunglasses, and of course, a ton of sunscreen. Look at this pool, it's just the perfect view. They're building something over here on this other island. I'm not really sure what it is, but this is the afternoon plan. We're gonna just enjoy the pool. We had an amazing day by the pool. I'm just touching up my makeup right now thought I would update you guys. If you hear a strange buzzing noise, there's something like across the lane, construction, something going on. It's been going on all day. We're gonna go to dinner now. 
I'm just touching up my eye makeup somehow kind of stay together, which is nice. This place is so beautiful. The sunset was amazing. We got some great pictures. We have two main dinner restaurants on the island and one of them is like Arabic and Indian cuisine. The other one is Mediterranean. I'm using these miniature Tarte Shape Tape concealers. Oh, I forgot to show you my foundation as well. It's a YSL like tinted moisturizer almost. Almost like a light foundation. I don't really think it's like a tinted moisturizer, but I love that for pool days because it looks pretty natural and it's easy to layer like, you know, it's like sweat and sunscreen and it comes off. So that's something I always have on holiday with me. And I don't really bother to contour when I'm on holiday. So I've just got the Dior blush. I've been using this for years, like before that whole fake Kylie thing happened where they were like, oh, this is Kylie's blush, but it was actually like not the blush she uses. But I've been using this color since university. They had it as limited edition. Now it's like their permanent collection. I love this color. It's great for fair skin. I just touch up my brows with this is a very well-loved Glossier Boy Brow. I'm using the monitor because they don't give you a tiny mirror. I can't see it without my glasses to the big mirror across this table. Little spritz. I love these. So whenever I shop at Louis Vuitton and I get these little perfume samples, I save them for vacations and it's just like the perfect scent. This one is California Dream. I like this one, but not enough to get a big one. The one I like the most and what I have in my collection is Cactus Garden. Yeah. So the lighting is not great, but that's the vacation makeup look and now let me get ready. Here's our dinner look, this yellow dress, my Coco handle, my Hermes Twilly as a scarf, and let me show you my shoes. Sorry, there's not a good full length mirror in here. So we've got the Hermes Orans with the Twilly dolls tied around them, and we're off to dinner. looks amazing. We have a scallop risotto, a beetroot salad, some mashed potatoes. My love is having the lamb. Good morning. It's day two of our staycation. The loud rumbly noise that you hear in the background is construction and it continued all through the night. But that being said, this place is absolutely stunning and I still would recommend it. We are about to head out to breakfast and then try some stand-up paddle boarding. I used to do workout classes on stand-up paddle boards. So I'm really excited to get back on one. And we have a spa booked for later for a couple's massage. We just come for breakfast. It's the same restaurant we came for dinner last night. They have an amazing menu, a lot of gluten-free options. They bring you out a fruit platter and I've got an iced tea and a green juice and we're waiting for the rest of our food now. Wow, this looks delicious. They've done a gluten-free avocado toast for me and this is the cheese platter. And my love has an Indian omelet and chicken sausage. For an included breakfast, this is really amazing. Like you can order as much as you want. beach my love is gonna do this like motorized thing I'm gonna do some stand-up paddle boarding Typically you can see the Dubai skyline here but it's quite foggy it was yesterday as well so I'm hoping tomorrow that in the day we can see the skyline let's get to paddle boarding I am in my giving movement set with my petite the brand shirt and yes this is how I'm going paddle boarding and even with sunscreen I'm gonna burn so this is the look I'm gonna tie up the shirt and go just like this. Obviously, I'm gonna put my bag inside, but this is what we're working with. But he's just had his lesson, and now he's got this like helmet on. They like talk to you while you do it. It's so nice out here. We're on the water paddle boarding. Cat fell in the water, but I did not. I think I need to get a GoPro though, because I'm taking a risk. I have my phone and my actual vlogging camera out on the paddle board. It is. I'm trying to convince him now that we need paddle boards and this is going to be like our regular exercise because I love being on the water and I think he might be coming around. He did enjoy the paddle boards. He did it for half an hour with me. The board had to warm up but now let me just get turned around so I can get a better video of him trying to do this hoverboard because now he's standing on it.
was it, babe? It was fun. You enjoyed it? To get a swing of it, then it's really nice. Yeah? And it's like very effortless. Now we are gonna go take a quick shower and off to the spa for a massage. This pool of fresh coconut water and like honestly you're set for the afternoon. It's so lovely here. And this is the sunset side. So the sunset sets right over there and it's absolutely gorgeous. Here's my going to the spa look. I always love a loose dress. This one's from Zara. I've got my XXL scrunchie. I found them on TikTok, cute brand. And my little bag. We are back in the room and I have ordered a pitcher of sangria, the same sangria we had last night, the pomegranate flavor, it was delicious. We decided to have our sunset drinks in the villa itself because the observation deck, I don't think you're gonna be able to see the Dubai skyline. It's been a little foggy since we've arrived. So typically if it's a clear day, the best plan would be five o'clock, go to that restaurant for a couple of drinks, enjoy the sunset and then have your dinner thereafter. And that was our plan. But since we can't see the skyline anyways, we figured let's enjoy the villa tonight. Of course, we'll take a few pictures as well. I'm wearing Frankie's bikinis. I will link the style below if they still have it in stock. And XXL scrunchies, my Chanel sunnies. And we're just going to enjoy this pool and watch the sunset. Look at this absolutely stunning view. We've just decided that tonight we're gonna enjoy the villa. We're ordering in some room service. We're gonna play some Uno. I don't know if you guys have a cute little couple thing you do on all your vacations, but Uno is our little thing. And I, oh my gosh, I just cannot get over this view. Look at this. Wow. It's unbelievable. It's just so gorgeous. And the pool is lit at night, so maybe we can even go for a night swim. Get in some food to the room. We've got a gluten-free carbonara. Babe has a lamb Indian dish, and I've got a club sandwich. Dinner looks pretty good. Oh, and a teeny tiny creme brulee. Just came for a turn down service, and they leave this cute little chocolate on the bed. They just have such amazing hospitality here. We're really impressed. Which one do you want to play, babe? Uno or Uno All Wild? This is our last morning here and we have a very exciting breakfast this morning. Well, I do. Babe is not into the pool breakfast, but look at this. It's floating and I'm super excited about it. Okay, admittedly, I did already eat the pancakes because I was hungry and I totally forgot to vlog this, but how magical is this breakfast this morning. We order this to the room. It comes with either a bottle of Prosecco or a bottle of sparkling date juice, which is delicious. We went for the date juice. a nice little bath and now I'm doing some face masks we've got about an hour before they come and get the luggage and we start our checkout this has just been such a dream it's so peaceful you really don't feel like you're in Dubai the service cannot be matched we had amazing service the whole time and I would highly recommend this place they're really gluten-free friendly I didn't feel like I missed out on anything which being gluten-free I typically do so if you're looking for a really nice beautiful staycation in Dubai I highly recommend